2004 Desmond custom model formerly owned by Juan Gonzalez of Las Vegas. <clears throat> I made this guitar for Juan back in 2004, 2003-2004. <clears throat> and he owned it for 16 years and stopped playing classical at some point. He sent it back to me and asked me if I would sell it for him. So I've had it for a couple of years. I wanted to buy it back and it never sold um, for whatever reason, I don't know, but uh, didn't really advertise it much. <clears throat> I've been so busy <coughs> making new guitars. But anyway, uh, recently I put it on reverb and it finally sold to a gentleman in California who will be very happy with it. This is a beautiful sounding guitar. It is based on my years learning the craft of making guitars from Manuel Velasquez. So this guitar is based on one of his, or based on his design. This is my own custom rosette design. All natural veneers, no colored veneers. and a beautiful German spruce top which has been French polished and I did retouch it up when I got it back from Juan to bring it back to brand new condition did not require any sanding of the wood or anything like that it only had a few little blemishes in it very minor stuff the back and sides are gorgeous Brazilian rosewood I'm going to flip it over here carefully I just shined it up with some rubbing compound. And this is all oil varnish, a technique I learned from Velasquez. And it's a high gloss. Beautiful finish. Beautiful Brazilian rosewood. Custom made marquetry, which I made. Uh, satin wood mahogany, bloodwood, Brazilian rosewood, purple heart, and paduke. You can see how beautiful the finish is. That's the Desmond head crest, David Rogers tuning machines, custom made in England, mahogany neck for sustain. And killer high gloss varnish finish. All hand rubbed, no buffing wheel or anything like that. This is all hand done. So anyway, it's going off to California today. Uh, new owner. It's in mint condition. It's an incredible guitar. And uh, fairly expensive, mid-range, $10,000. I think it's a great value for the money. So, there you have it. I have to say goodbye to this beauty.